Bible teacher, Carlos Carrillo. Get ready to study your Bible. Good evening, everybody. Welcome to Are You Ready? We have something very important. As you can see, we need to talk about, we need to pray. All right, welcome to Are You Ready? If you're watching, Are You Ready? Please subscribe, click notification, thumbs up if you like this video. Salute. Mm. Gray water, let's pray. Heavenly Father, we love you and we praise you. We ask divine direction, everything that we speak. Touch people, bring comfort and peace to those who are hurting right now. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, as you can see right here, ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters, Two FBI agents killed in a shooting in Florida that happened this morning. Three other agents were injured in a shooting occurred in um, as agents were serving a warrant in Sunrise, Florida, a few miles from Fort Lauderdale. The sun had not come up yet on Tuesday when a group of FBI agents assigned to investigate criminals who prey on children online approached the Water Terrace Apartments in Sunrise, Florida to execute a search warrant, routine part of a job that is always fraught with risk. When ex what exactly happened in the ensuing minutes is unknown, but a gun battle broke out, rousting uh, neighbors out of bed in the quiet residential community. Law enforcement officials called emergency dispatchers. And as you can see, two FBI agents died and three more were injured in one of the deadliest shootings in the Bureau's history. This only, the last time this happened was 35 years ago in 1986 in Miami Day. Let's go here. Let's watch this video from Fox. We've been following the story in the last few minutes, and of course, we saw that stunning scene uh, after two FBI agents were killed this morning in Sunrise, Florida. Three others were told, at least three others were wounded. The agents were serving a warrant in a child pornography and violence against children's case and the suspect is also dead again we don't have the emerging details on that yet okay let's go over here as they say it's sad to bring the body into the the morgue right there Come. sadly uh, similar operations being carried out by uh u.s marshals they are very dangerous as i mentioned uh but it's rare that you hear about this kind of uh situation with fbi agents serving a warrant so we look back and what we found was a, a similar loss of life uh in 1986 in what is now mm -hmm. the Pinecrest area of South Florida, where you had two agents who who uh, took on two serial bank robbers, uh, and they were killed in the line of duty. And after that incident in South Florida, you had this uh, overhaul of procedures and even the type of weaponry that FBI agents carry with them, because even though in that case as well, you had suspects who were outnumbered, uh, you still had the loss of life by law enforcement. And so, you know, there's just to put this into perspective today, you know, it, it caught our attention because it involves FBI agents serving a warrant. And then, you know, it's not like this is some uh, terrorism investigation. Uh, this was a crimes against children case. Uh, and so it, it, we need to pray for these uh, these FBI family members. Let's hear here from the FBI speaking right now. Let's listen. We need to pray for the family members, ladies and gentlemen. We're living in the last days. First of all, Matthew 24, 12, because lawlessness will increase so much, the love of many will grow cold, but the one who endures to the end will be saved. The uh, people will Alfin and Schwarzenberger, pray for them. Comfort and peace comes from God. Blessed is the father of all comfort. 